So this is how it works. It sorts the coins by their size. So even though a dime is worth more than a penny, the dime is slightly smaller. If you can tell, it's slightly smaller. So this um uh this has many different um areas for different coins. So this one's for dimes, pennies, nickels, quarters, loonies, and toonies over there. So um this first one's for dimes, so the dime is just small enough, so it goes underneath this Lego this Lego piece. So um, but when you put the penny through, it's just tall enough, as you can see right there, just tall enough, so it goes by, by this, and then it goes into its hole over here because it's short, it's short enough, so it falls through, and that just keeps repeating for every, um, coin, so for the nickel, the nickel's tall enough to go past the dime and penny, but it's not tall enough. For this one, so it goes underneath it. Same with the quarter. Quarter is tall enough to go over all these, but isn't tall enough um, for this hole over here. So it slips underneath and goes through. And then the last spot is over there for um, loonies and toonies. So loonies and toonies go uh, past the quarter slot and into this hole over here so um that's how that's how it sorts the co sorts the coins but for it to actually work um you have to have it raised so over here you just put a couple bricks and you just put it underneath and have it raised but you also have to have it tilted or else the um, coins will just go all the way to the end if you don't have it tilted because they need to ride along these rails over here so you have to add a piece over here and it makes it so that it's tilted so the coins will ride along um, these top pieces instead of going straight so that's how um, that's how my coin sort of works if you guys want a tutorial let me know in the comments down below and uh, thank you for watching yeah!